Stewart and Yusuf Islam yeah. was on. He performed, which yes, I he thought did. was he, he came out. He kind of laid it on you that fact. Yes, he, he did. So how did you feel about that? Not good. Not good. Uh, uh, actually, you know, he's dropped the Islam now for mysterious no, reasons. Just Yusuf. <laughs> yes, he's just Yusuf, like Cher and Madonna, <laughs> <laughs> except with a very big beard. Yeah. It is a pretty great beard. <laughs> Imagine Cher with a very big beard. <laughs> People like can that. this weekend in burlesque. Um, yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, but I mean, I actually was. I thought it was a mistake to have invited him, and I actually called up John Stewart, and we had a couple of conversations. And I think, you know, by the end of it, I think he's pretty clear that it that it was a, probably a misstep. You know, because he's he's not a good guy. Are he's you? not. I mean, it may be that he once sang Peace Train, and I mean, there was a point when I was a college student when I had a copy of Tea for the Tiller Man. Yeah. You know, but uh, he's not. He hasn't been Cat Stevens for a long time. You know, he's a different guy now. Are you a different guy from that guy who wrote that book and was in that? I'm older, but I'm the same writer. Yeah. You know, I mean, I I feel very proud of that book, and I think one of the great things about the time having passed is that now people can read the Satanic Verses as a novel, you know, right. instead of as some kind of hot potato. As it was intended to be. Yeah, and so now some people like it, some people don't like it, but that's the ordinary life of a book, right. you know, and it's finally able to have that. Is there any, any, any fear at all because now that you're going to relive that and reprint some of that stuff? No, I think we have to stop thinking. That's, that's pussy thinking. Yeah. You know, you have to, nice. <laughs> you have to not 